Good morning, everybody. Uh, Grandma D here. Um, I am here for a, another unboxing video. I got a package. I'm super excited. Um, I got a package from Reb Fab Stash. Yay! I took a trip this week and uh, it was here when I got home. Could not wait for this morning so I could get up to my uh, computer here and uh, show you what I got. Super excited. I ordered this fabric over a period of two live events over a couple of weeks. Uh, Rev Fab Stash is a quilt shop out in Idaho, and I am an affiliate with Revs. So if you like what you see here today in this video, I will put a link down in the notes for my affiliate. And you can go through my link and go to their website and uh, pick some goodies for yourself. They have a great clearance section. They have a lot of great uh, fabric and sewing products there available for you. Um, and it would help me out if you used my link, and I would appreciate that very much. Um, so let's go ahead and get started and see what I got. I kind of know what's in here because, like I said, I bought it over the period of two live events. So I know what's in here, but it's awesome. You're going to love it. I'm going to turn you a little bit because the sun is coming up out there. Yay, the sun is out. We're super excited. So, and actually, there's something in here that I had ordered a couple of weeks ago. Like, gosh, I don't know, over a month ago and it was back ordered. And so uh, they finally sent it to me with my order. So let's see. I got a whole bunch of invoices here because I ordered a lot of stuff. So, uh, okay, there's that. Okay. Oh, oh, wait. It says my, oh, there, wait. Okay, there it is. Okay, I see. Um, okay, so the first thing that I ordered was um, a pattern called All Bottled Up. I'm looking for that. Um, I want to say it was $9. I want to say something like that. But this is the pattern that I got. It's called All Bottled Up and makes these little bags. I'm kind of wanting to try some new stuff. And so I thought I would, I ordered this on a live. I got it on sale. I want to say it was $9.99 and I got it at like, I don't know, maybe like 15% off or something like that. And it was a while ago and it was back ordered. They just got them in. They're softly padded zipper bags in three sizes. And it's called, it's made by a company called By Annie. And I have seen their bags um, done through Rebs, done through Tula Pink. She has done bags with them as well. And they looked really nice. And um, they use soft and stable for cushioning. And on the back here is all your product requirements and the different bags that you can get in the back. Um, Let's see. Now, this is the pattern only. And uh, like I said, they're super cute. And I'm really excited to give them a try because I'm going to be making some Hemingway bags as well. And in a previous unboxing that I did today for the products that I bought while I was in Minnesota is some great zippers that you might want to take a look at that. So I can put a link to that video in here as well. Um, and then I have a tabletop ironing board that is smaller by my, it's staged by my sewing machine in my sewing room. And, um, I'm going to use this. It's heat resistant batting by Lori Holt. I'm going to use this for covering my, underneath my fabric on my ironing board. I'm going to give it a facelift because... The fabric on it is torn and it's not very good and it isn't working very well anymore. So now this was, um, let's see. Oh my gosh, I got so many papers here. Uh, this heat resistant batting is $7.95. So uh, that, uh, let's see, that is the regular price. And then I think I got it like 10% off or something. So I was like, yeah, I'll take that because I've been wanting to get some to recover that ironing board. 
And then the next thing I got are, they're called Cute Cuts Quarter Inch Marking Ruler. Uh, let's see, where's the front? Here's the front. So this is what they look like. They mark your quarter inch for quilting. And uh, they are super cute. I'm really excited to use these. These were $11.95. And um, I think they were they were ten percent off, and I thought you know what those are really nice, and I think I would use those. I'm really kind of uh, cautious about rulers. I don't I don't buy rulers that because they're the latest and greatest, and there's something that oh yeah I I'm gonna get that because it's the best thing now out there. No, I I have a very small repertoire of rulers and these are going to join that um i think it's really nice and it almost looks like it's a little magnified like the writing on there is a little magnified let me pull one out of the box here if i can get this one. now there's two of them in here this is what it looks like and there's the measurements okay um this is really nice. I think I'm going to really like this ruler. Um, now, it appears to me that this is a half inch across here, and then it has a line down the middle that I believe is your quarter inch marking right there, and across here is probably a half inch. So uh, that's really nice. So you got the bigger one, and then there is one smaller one here. This would be nice if you're doing small HSTs or anything like that, you know. Um, and they are grippy on the back. These little flowers, I can feel it. They're grippy on the back. So that's really nice. Um, set of two marking rulers, one half inch by six and a half, which is this one. And then one half inch by 12 and a half, which is this one. Um Perfect for marking your sewing lines, seam allowances, and more. Great to use with Lori's Busy Bee pencils. So, I mean, if, you, if you're trying to stay on um, brand, you can certainly get her Busy Bee pencils. I personally use regular lead, number two lead pencils. They work fine. And you don't have to have a super dark line. I'm sorry, my chair feels funny. You don't have to have a super dark line just huh, enough to see and if you're not using white fabric okay as an example if you're using a fabric that's tan or cream or green you can mark on there and it will wash out eventually and you're not going to see it on the front of the fabric and it's not going to go anywhere it's not going to disappear over time Okay, so like you can mark your fabrics this week and come back in two weeks on a Saturday when you have time and it's still there. <laughs> so, and pencils are everywhere. So, I mean, give it a try. Give it a try. Now, I would be careful with white, you know, but I mean, uh, there are other pencils for white that are disappearing and heat disappearing and all the things, and you can certainly use those. So, I got these. And I got, I got some fabric. I'm so excited for my Hemingway bags. I'm super excited. Um, now these are, let me see, um, snowmen. It's called Snowed In Gray Snowmen in Medallion. Now these are the medallions. And this is gray. I hope that you can see that. I got two yards of this. This is so beautiful. I mean, I know it says gray. It almost has a brown undertone to it, but it's so pretty. I love this fabric. I, I, I'm more, um, I don't go really big, um, bright, bold. That's just not my thing at all. And this is really in my wheelhouse. And it's really beautiful, beautiful medallions. And all three of these fabrics are from the same product line, snowed in um, by Heather Peterson for Riley Blake Designs, uh, Christmas Snowmen in Winter. Uh, now, this could 
I mean, I know it's winter. This could go like anytime, you know, because it's it's medallions and they do look like snowflakes, but they kind of resemble flowers as well. So you could you could totally do that for this. Oops, picked up the other one with it. <laughs> now this is another one that goes with it. This one is black snowed in sketch dots. Now, if you look at the dots, you can see they have like a little design on the dot, like a sketch drawn design on the dot. And that that's what I really liked because I like dots, but this kind of quiets them down a little bit. And this color in here matches this. They because they're in the same line, they they look just beautiful together. They look beautiful together. See that now this again, this is called. Black Snowed In Sketch Dots by Heather Peterson for Riley Blake. If you like these, you can go to Rebs through my affiliate link and maybe get some for yourself. This is beautiful. And it feels so nice. It feels, gosh, almost linen-y. linen -y? Is that a word? Um, but uh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. And so the last one. This is so cute. Uh, Hoss Snowmen. Look at that. They look like little marshmallows. They look like little marshmallows. Look at that. How cute is that? And that is on gray with the white background dots. Now the white background dots are white and the scarves on the little snowmen are like a pink, like two tones of pink, the lighter color, and then the little darker color on the end. And they have a little orange carrot nose and little black stick arms it's so cute and this is called uh let's see uh there's the medallion the sketch dots this one is called warm wishes stone snowmen um by simple simon and company for riley blake Holiday Winter Christmas. It's called Stone Snowmen. So this one is different, but they go together so well. I was like, yeah, I think that works just fine. I think these these are going to be so cute for my Hemingway bags. I'm super excited. Now, in a previous video, in my other video, I had told you about item, some zippers that I got. And, um, these are the zippers that I got from Hobby Lobby. Now, I had bought these. These are brown, and I had bought them for this, for the Hemingway bags. Good. I think they're going to be beautiful. And I did get white ones, which I could use the white. Um, And I got black i got a couple of black ones so i've got some choices here and here's the tan one these are my choices for my zippers for my hemingway bags i'm pretty excited i can't wait to get started on those and i am going to uh do them on a um let's sew together uh put that there under that title on my channel so you can see that and um I'm new at bags, so, um, you know, don't look for perfection here, but we'll do it together. We'll get through it. So, uh, but this, again, is the Stone Snowmen, uh, Simple Simon & Company by Riot for Riley Blake Designs. And those little guys are so cute. Aren't they cute? Uh, so, um... Big shout out to Christy and the crew at Rebs Fab Stash. They're awesome. I love my stuff. I love everything I got. And they also uh, put these in for you. So you can, uh, if you want to learn more about their website. Now they do offer a fantastic stash box. Now, my video for the uh, windmill bag, my video series, it's a three video series for the windmill bag. That's from Rebs. My apron that I wear in my cooking videos, stash box again. Both of those items were from their stash boxes. Um, 
and their stash boxes are monthly. And if you would be interested, you can follow my link and go to their website and maybe sign up for their stash box, $49.95. And I mean, it's full of projects. It's not just a box of fabric. It's projects with pre-cut fabric to go with them. And you get um, Rebs Fab Stash Swag. Lots of goodies there to be had. Great, great, great. Um, and they also have um, a variety of ways that you can see them. They're YouTube live videos. That's where I go and I look for fabric because she does a real great job of describing and explaining. And a lot of times you get a little bit off, which, hey, you know, that's always helpful. Um, and then you can stay up to date through their social media um, and you can subscribe to their uh, stash box. And then um, the Tuesday and Thursday, they have stash sales. So there is that. And then uh, these are links that you are more than welcome to uh, take a snip of this page and follow the links. These are affiliate links that they have uh, for places that they're affiliated with. If you would like to, if you're into embroidery and you would like to have a look at that, you most certainly can do that. So that's what I have. So let's recap really quick. I got my, um, my heat resistant batting. I'm going to do my ironing board and I will also, uh, maybe do a video for that. I will let you know about that. And then I got my all bottled up pattern. Pretty excited to do that. And my my two Lori Holt quarter inch rulers. Very nice. And my, the best part, ta -da! my fabric. Um, again, all by Riley Blake Designs. And you can probably still find some of this on their webpage. If not, I'm sure you'll find something very similar. They have a lot of great fabric. So... That's what I have today for my unboxing from Reps Fab Stash in Moscow, Idaho. And uh, I hope that you enjoyed this unboxing and that you will come back next time for another great time as we unbox more great stuff. Um, and also, again, I will put the affiliate link in the notes below for Reps Fab Stash. And um, I can also put a link to my uh, video series for the windmill bag if you would be interested and in having a look at that as well. So uh, this is Grandma D saying goodbye for today. And I hope that you have a great day today and a better day tomorrow. And I hope that you will subscribe to my channel, like this video, and click the notification bell. Do the big three things. So uh, you have a wonderful day, and we'll talk soon. Have a great day. Bye-bye.